I only have 30 seconds. I have to ask you, MGM yeah. has filed a lawsuit yeah. naming the victims of the October 1st shooting at Mandalay Bay as defendants. Why? Yeah. So first, uh, despicable act by an evil person. Uh, a lot of the victims' families are my employees. Um, we've been on this since obviously 1 October. We don't want a nickel from anybody. What we're trying to do is consolidate cases. There are hundreds of cases. Uh, and put them into federal court. That's what Congress intended when they passed the Safety Act after 9-11. And if we can accomplish that, put these cases into federal court, uh, these, all these cases will be adjudicated. The victims, their families, everyone affected will get their money quicker. Um, and that's all that we want to do. Uh, it, I know the headlines were awful. It made me sick to look at them. It was never our intent to hurt anybody. Our intent is to for my own employees, including my CFO, who was at the concert that night, we want everyone uh, to be able to get their day in court as soon as possible. Uh, Jim Murren, thank you so much for being candid with us. A billion three property, this is going to open at the end of the year and it's going to gush cash. We're going to probably make $200 million a year in that property. I'm just a guy working at a company that I'm, I'm honored to work for. And last question, Vegas is really doing well. Isn't yeah, it? yeah. You know, it's supply and demand, Jim. Yeah. So uh, demand's growing rapidly. Uh, Vegas is back, and no one's building new stuff. And by the way, you can't because these big guys that we own, they cost a million dollars a room. You cannot build a property <laughs> today <laughs> for, more than, for less than four or five or six billion dollars. So, so no one's coming in. And if the market keeps growing, it's good for the home team, and MGM's the home team. Wow. Well, it's a great, both are great stories. But you were an outspoken yep. supporter uh, of Hillary Clinton in the last election. So now that you've been I was. able, now that you've been able to see everything, and, and as a Republican, you probably like deregulation a little, I guess, and maybe the tax reform bill. Um, do you still wish your, your, the candidate that you backed had won in 2016, Jim? I do, yes.